Bam, 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 baby, I'm live. It's Jose Trujillo, world's greatest living artist, with his trusted Starbucks. Yeah. All right, let's do this. Gotta do a painting, baby. Gotta do a painting. Gotta do a painting. Gotta, 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 gotta do a painting. Let's do this. So, ooh la la, I'm a painting. Gotta do a painting, gotta do a painting. Gotta, 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 gotta do a painting. Ooh la la, mucho painting. Right. Hey, someone told me the other day on on uh, on YouTube. They're like, you you crappy artist. Hey, <laughs> I guess someone tells me that every day. I'm like, I'm like, stop it! Don't hurt my feelings. Don't hurt my feelings telling me I'm a crappy artist. I'm a great artist. As a matter of fact, I am the world's greatest living artist. Don't be telling me I'm a crappy artist. Yeah. Good morning. Cambodia, I love that. I love that. This is what's cool about the internet. What's cool about the internet is that we get to we get to uh, talk to all kinds of awesome people from different places. Yeah, there we go. Ooh la la. Let's see. Yeah, there it is. I wish that was a painting. That would be so awesome if that was a painting. If it, if it ended like that. Ending on a good note. Ending with paintings on a great note. Yeah. All right, let's do this. So part of the whole system that I use to create artwork is, um, those of you who don't know yet, is you really have to keep moving and regardless of how you paint you really have to keep moving it's really the only way that I found to find that I found to find uh, sanity in painting painting is a very strange act it's a very it's a very interesting thing to do uh, if you're not careful uh, you end up sort of hating it if you're not careful. Like everything else, right, that you're not careful with. You end up sort of hating it. I think that there's a lot of people that say that they don't hate it, but you wouldn't do it every day. <laughs> the reason why is because when you start doing something every day, it starts becoming a little bit difficult, right? It starts becoming difficult. Because now you're, now you're, now you're fighting with your or dealing, whatever words you want to use, because you're like, I don't fight with anything. Okay, maybe you don't. Sorry, Oprah. But I'm just saying, maybe, maybe, maybe you're dealing, you're challenging yourself with uh, showing up. You know, as simple as showing up. You're dealing with your mind now. There's a different thing happening, right? Maybe there's different stuff happening. You know, and and you no longer just do it when you feel like it. Now, now you have to do it even when you don't feel like it. Can you imagine that? Now you have to do stuff when you don't feel like it. This is why I think that painting becomes a bit more difficult. Painting starts becoming a little bit more legendary. <laughs> it starts becoming a little bit more legendary when you... Uh, I like that word. I just want to use it. When you now have to show up regardless of how you feel like. All right, regardless of what you think at that precise moment, now you have to really show up. And, and I think that that is one of the, one of the reasons why a lot of people uh, just uh, stop painting. You just stop painting. Because any sane person would do it, right? Any sane person would stop painting. 
But if you're local like me, then you, you, you push past that pain. There's a pain. Don't, 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 don't believe people that tell you there's no pain. There is definitely a pain happening. You know, there's a pain happening with, with creating art. The pain is your own limitations, your personal limitations. That's the pain. The pain is, is your personal je ne sais quoi. Your, your inability or ability, whatever it is, to, uh, to show up even though you don't feel like it. You know? In sickness and in health. Right? You show up even though you're like, ah, I mean, should I be doing this today? I'm not inspired. But if you're a pro or you want to be a pro, you're going to have to go, well, the hell with this. No one, no one told me to do this. I told myself, right? I think I'm going to show up regardless. I mean, I would love to sit here and cry like a little baby, but I can't, right? So that, I think that's, that's when, it, when, when anything, it's not just painting, but when anything becomes extremely rewarding is when you start showing up when you don't want to. And that's, that's I think, guys, I don't know. I mean, don't, don't, don't listen to me. Do your thing. That's what I think when, when life really starts rewarding you for it. When you don't feel like doing it. Do it when it starts hurting. That's when you start counting. I think, I think it was, uh, uh, who was it? Was it, was it Ali, Muhammad Ali, I think, who said that? I think it was him who said it. I don't know if it was him or it was Tyson. One of those awesome, awesome athletes said that. You don't start counting your exercises until it starts hurting. I don't start counting my paintings until it starts hurting. When it starts hurting, that's when I know, oh man, okay, I'm, on, I'm onto something now. And I do mean hurting both psychologically and physically. When my arm starts getting tired, that's when I'm like, oh man, I, I think I might be onto something. When my arm starts getting tired, that's when I know that I barely started painting. Isn't it, isn't it crazy? I wish I could lie to you. It would sound probably cooler if I lie, but I'm not the lying type. It's only when it starts hurting that I'm like, oh man, you know. Thank you so much, Luke Lulu. Luke Lulu, I love that. Luke Lulu. Yeah, it's only when it starts hurting that you're like, oh man, okay, I think I'm onto something. I'm onto something now. I think that now. See, what starts happening is that you start owning the pain. If you don't own the pain, then you're going to have a hard time painting. Or doing anything, I think. Anything worth noting, right? Anything worth noting. It's only when I'm I'm going local when I'm going like this. See, because I believe that the art comes out of the movement. And if you're not ready to move, like if you're not if you're not ready to move, to really move, you know, to move, to constantly be moving, then you might have a hard time creating art. Now this is this is not for everybody, right? You could create artwork in many different ways. But what I'm trying to what I'm trying to talk about here is the movement of looseness, right? To be loose. You can take your time, you know? Everybody paints different. Uh, I'm sure that uh, Chuck Close doesn't paint like me, you know? He doesn't paint like me. I'm not saying that in order to paint. I'm saying that regardless of what he does, he keeps moving, you know? He keeps moving. There's a movement. There's a... It, it, his jam is lower, right? But... But it keeps moving. His jam's slower. His jam's more like, you know, his jam's slower, but it doesn't stop. 
It doesn't stop, right? He's a little different. Hey, thank you so much, Kyle. Thank you, man. So that's... That's what I want to show. Oh, look. <laughs> that looks like a drop of a cry. Cry baby. There you go. Oh. It ain't finished till I sign my name. It says right there, right there. It says world's greatest living artist. Yeah. World's greatest living artist. That's my violinist. He's a... Uh, he's a... Uh, one of the musicians in the Titanic. <laughs> Titanic. Dude, I still love that movie. It's muy sad. All right. Well, anything else that I do, I'm just showing off because I really, I'm finished. Bam. Take that. All right, guys. I will talk to you guys soon again. Thank you so much. Thank you, thank you, thank you. This painting is going to be auctioned at 99 cents in my eBay shop. Oh, I love that. Desde Los Angeles, California. Thank you. I love that. Thank you so much. The city of angels. Pues ahí está. Thank you guys so much. This painting is going to go to my, uh, my eBay shop. I'm going to auction this bad boy. Hey, thank you so much, uh, uh, Alex, Alexan, Alexan, there, uh, Arlene, Alexander Arlene. There we go. Thank you. I appreciate that. All right, guys. If you guys want a shot at winning this painting, the auction's going to start at 99 cents. Uh, go check it out. I'm going to put a, a link somewhere around here. Or, uh, or, or DM me if you want a direct link to it. All right? Take care. Adios, muchachos. Y muchachas.